Okay. All right, are you ready? Always. Yeah. Today we're gonna work on our hips and our abs. Okay. So we're gonna start with some little stretches, ne our neck exercise. Okay. So hands to your side, and you're gonna tilt your head forward and backward. Just drop your head five times each way. Loosen up. After that, we're gonna look to your right and left five times. <laughs> and then tilt your right ear to your right shoulder and left ear to left shoulder five times each way. I'll do some circles as many five probably each way. Alright, you can do some shoulder rolls. That's tight. Alright, so now lift your arms into the air, grab your right wrist, and lean to your left. So feeling your oblique. Mm -hmm. Now we're gonna take put your weight on your left foot, lift your right foot up yes, and put it behind. Left. Leaning and stretching. Okay, do shoulder rolls. Now we're gonna go the opposite way, grab your left wrist. Weight on your right foot, put your left leg behind you. Shoulder rolls. Okay. So now we're gonna go into sun salutation. So bring your hands to your chest in the prayer pose. Extend up. Inhale. Exhale. Extend down. Hands on the ground. And move one leg back at a time. So you're gonna like a high plank. <laughs> what? Oh. All right, now bend down. Don't let your hips touch the ground and slide forward. <laughs> your chest up. Okay, now we're gonna move into downward dog. <laughs> Put your head between your shoulders. <laughs> no, you're fine. You can walk it out a little bit, stretch out your hamstring. All right. <laughs> One foot forward at a time. Extend down. Now reach up slowly around. Back into prayer pose. Perfect. Uh -oh. The best yoga instructor ever. Thanks. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so we're going to do that again to get down. So extend up. Exhale down. One foot back and down. We're going to go into cobra pose. So put your shoulder blades together and your head back. Open up your chest. Okay, stay there. So now we're going to do the locust pose. So we're going to go down. Put your hands underneath your stomach, your elbows as close together as possible. We're gonna do half locus. Perfect. Oh no. There you go. Nice. Okay. Great skills. <laughs> half locus. So we're gonna go down, lift one leg up at a time, as high as you can, and lift your chest up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, switch legs. Legs. <laughs> okay. 
Oh my god, so I'm digging the <laughs> Okay. Down. Now we're gonna do both legs. No. Yeah, so lift your legs up first. And then lift your chest. <laughs> Breathe. I literally cannot feel my Inhale, legs. exhale, inhale through your nose. <laughs> Slow breathing. Drop. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm getting a high plank. Feet up. Bend. Inhale. I feel like that's a better plank. Yeah, that is good. Okay. Straight up, I'm actually allergic to grass. That was not good. Take a step back though. I feel myself sneezing red. Okay, we're going to go back down to the bow pose, so down, extend, one foot back, slide forward, I'm really good at that now, yeah. good job, downward dog, hey okay, so now go down into your stomach, you're going to reach back and grab your corresponding foot for each hand, <laughs> Try and lift up. Oh so push your, push your, your feet against your hand. Hey, hey, class. We're in yoga class. Okay, push your feet against your hand. Keep breathing. What? Okay. Hey. Breathe. Focus. I'm with you. Focus. Hi. Lift your chest up, Nikki. Sorry, I'm, I gotta focus. <laughs> A few more seconds. <laughs> All right, coffee. release. All right, up one foot at a time. Extend forward. start this one. We're going to lift your right leg in the air as high as possible. Stay here for a little bit. Try and keep your right hip down, facing down still. Okay. Now we're going to pull it forward to the pigeon pose. So in front of you, you can stay up or you can go down on your elbows. Yeah, that's dumb. Not going to happen. And just breathe. Dude, I can't. My leg will explode. Breathe for a few seconds. You can put your forehead on your hand if you can. Yep. Okay. Okay. We're gonna do the other leg. Go back up. Lift your left leg in the air. Keep your left hip down. Pull through. Pigeon pose. This one's good. Keep breathing. Back up again, so one foot up, extend, unfold. All right, now we're gonna do a hip opener with a twist. So up, down, one foot back. We're gonna start with extending our right foot in the air again, like last time. Now bring it through in between your hands. You can drop your back knee if you need. Okay, in prayer pose, we're gonna take our left elbow over over our right knee and twist. And if you can, you can try and stand up on your back foot. Yeah, no. You could do that. <laughs> Keep breathing. Go grab a whole two seconds. Thank you. 
control content. Yeah. All right, now if you want to feel more twist, take your right hand and grab your left foot. Try and twist over. Move your hand down. Can I just stay in what I was in? Yeah, you could stay. All right. Unfold, put your leg back. Take you a little downward dog. If it feels good. Or child's pose, like this if you need. Walk it out a little bit. All right, lift your left leg up. Left hip down. All right, pull it through again. You can drop your knees. Prayer pose. Opposite way. Nice. Right arm over left leg. You can stand up if you can. Unfold back, feet together. Now up. All right. Now. How much is left? Not much. Okay. So now we're gonna do the boat pose. So up, fold down. Step back. Fly dog. Oh, I just want to take a downward dog. Okay, so we're gonna sit with our feet facing forward, like this. So to start, you can have your hands on the ground next to you. You can lift your knees up, and then lift your hands up at the same time. And if you could straighten them, hey. If you can straighten them, do that. We'll hold this. We'll do this three times for 15 seconds. Okay, relax. Okay, relax. All right, lift your knees, lift your hands, extend. Mm -hmm. All right, relax. We'll do one more. Okay, lift your knees, extend. Mm -hmm. Alright, relax. Okay. Okay, we're gonna go into another ab. So from here, um, alright, move to a tabletop pose. So on your hands and knees. And it's just gonna be extending the opposite arm and leg and then crunching in. So we'll do 15. Chapter 15.
Annie can go and down her dog. And step forward. Okay. This one's a little tricky. So we're gonna pull back down. One foot back. Okay. So from here, we'll start with our right leg. So we're gonna lift our right leg. You can watch me for this one and then do it. Lift your right leg up and then extend over as far as possible. It could, it's supposed to go all the way around into a back bend like that, but you don't have to do that. It's not gonna happen. Yeah. So foot up, really open that hip and extend over. You can try and go over into a back bend if you want. opposite pigeon and then we'll meditation and we're done so extend up forward <laughs> leg back lean forward stretch it out downward dog all right so this one we're gonna be laying on our back down, just pull your knee up and pull it to your chest. All right, switch. Nikki, this would help with your problem because it pushes on your chest. Yeah. <laughs> All right, release. Okay. All right, for the last two minutes, sit crisscross. We'll do some breathing. So hands in prayer pose, we're gonna work on alternate nostril breathing. Okay. So think of inhaling through your right, exhaling through your left nostril. Just close your eyes. Big deep breaths, relax for all the homework you have to do. All right, good job. So now you're gonna do hands to your head for kind thoughts, hands to your mouth for kind words, hands to your heart for good intentions. Om Shanti Shanti. Shanti, shanti. Good job. Woo. Done. <laughs>